Hey y'all, I am back, I am back, I'm back. Better late than never, right? Man, yay don't clear it on us. Yay is doing the yay, okay? Man, I ain't gonna bull crap. It's some weird stuff going on. I don't care what nobody say. It's like this man had an epiphany. And he's showing us, like, we haven't heard from Ye in a minute. And that's unlike him. Ye said, man, listen, I got my wife to divorce me. That was the best thing they could have did. You know why? When I think about it, separate assets. You won't be getting Kim stuff because when you're married, it's joint property. Okay? Yeah, when you marry, and then when you divorce, unless you have a prenup, then the, whatever's in that prenup, that's what the judge, yeah. That's why I've been telling people, marriage is a contract. That's right, the sign between two people that agree upon terms. That's right. Mm-hmm, anybody know that? But the true significance of marriage didn't come from that. True significance of marriage, from what I've read, came from making the peace. Yeah, making the peace with the Draconian family. Yeah, and it's some crazy stuff. Like, uh, I told people what I believed about what's going on here. They'll say, man, you don't lost your damn mind. But nah, see, for the people that think that we are the only ones on this planet, they don't have their mind. They are not thinking with their mind. Let me tell y'all something. People always talk about shapeshifters, right? But couldn't they honestly say that they saw one shapeshift right in their face? I'm going to tell y'all, in order to see, uh, uh, we are shapeshifters. Yeah, we are. But we just haven't perfected it. <clears throat> but these people perfected it in the way they keep it. Perfected is by keeping it all in the bloodline. That's why they don't want nobody else. People think, oh, well, some well to us it's nasty. To, yeah, to me, it's, I find it very disgusting. I'm not going to sit here and lie. But with them, some kind of way, them genes, I guess the closer they are, the DNA information is synchronized with one person to the next. That's what I'm starting to figure out. But I'm going to tell you, I have seen a shapeshifter, yeah, not once, but twice. And when I saw it, the, the first time, I ain't going to even sit here and lie. I'm going to be honest because I keep it real on my channel. That's my car in the back when I had a car. I think I would say this is 2016 or 15. Nah, nope, had to be before that. This had to be like in 2000 on this picture in 14, maybe, I want to say 15, or I think 15, or even the ending of 14, I saw the shapeshifter a year before that, maybe two years before I got that car. And this is the closest picture that I could get. This is how I looked at that time, <clears throat> the same hair. Those was a pair of my favorite boots with those true religion jeans. Boy, I couldn't get enough of those damn jeans. I wanna got like two, three pair. But anyhow, I'm not here to talk about jeans. I'm here to talk about lizards. What happened was, after I had gotten in that big, that bad car wreck and uh, the opium that I was prescribed, I, I couldn't take it, it was too strong. I thought I was gonna be out of here, real talk. In some kind of way, my son cooked for me, and I had got food poison. So John, at the time, came to my house, and he said, it's mind over matter, it's mind over matter. And I did use mind over matter, and my mind told me, if you act like it don't matter, if you ain't going to matter. Your matter going to go right with that matter you don't matter about. So something said, 
don't stay here. I didn't know at the time I was food poisoned. Something to me said, you got to get up at this house, go to the hospital. So I think my son's call or either John called the ambulance at the time. And they came. And this man was acting so hostile. He was so mean and he was a Caucasian. He has not. This is no exaggeration. This stuff wasn't snot, but a person would say that it's not, but it looked like a gelatin coming out his nose, and I'm able to see this. This man totally was aggressive, no love, no compassion, and I didn't know about these uh, things at the time. I didn't know about no reptilian shapeshifters. I didn't know nothing about it. And when I saw his face, that thing shifted. I told my sons, I promise when my sons come over, I'm going to ask them, say, remember when I told y'all about what I saw with that man? Because they got mad. They were like, damn, why you treating our mama like this? And they were small at that time. They wasn't, I think Javon was like, about 15, 14, but he wasn't, you know? And, um... Yeah, I saw it, and what happened was, when I got to the hospital, they 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 even looked at him. Even his even the man he was traveling with told him stop it. He told him calm down. It was something I'm telling y'all. And years later, something you know came in me, and I just started researching, and. Then after I started looking this stuff up, like people like lizard walking and stuff like that. Then David Ike came along. Then he brought the elder from Africa, from the Zulu, the shaman, Kratos. And then uh, Deborah Blair. And then, you know, even before then, I saw one. I saw one this time, but I don't really, 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 really count that one. But I will because... Even though I was on Molly at the time, I was in my right mind. Yeah, I wasn't hallucinating. No, I saw it for what it was. And I was a Christian at the time. And I said, man, I told my son I ran out the store. I said, man, I just saw a, a alien. He was like, what? I was on my way taking him to Diller High School. I would never, ever, ever forget it. But in order to see those reptilians, you have to be on a certain vibration and that's what I was on because I had just got out of the hospital and I was in the I don't know how long I was in the I had to ask my children. I don't remember. But I was purified. Real talk I went through everything. Yeah, I'm being honest. And I think I talked about that in one video, but it was on my mind about these reptilians. In order to see them, they walk amongst us every day. They could live right next door to you, be serving you your food. And, um, yeah, trust me, I'm telling y'all, they, they walk amongst us. They always have. They always will. They was here before humans was, was, was here. They was here. Our ancestors saw them. That's why, have y'all ever asked yourself, why was the ancient people killed, dog? And these people here, I'll tell you why in the next video. But for now, they walk amongst man and woman, unlike man and woman. And when the veil is lifted, they have a serpent face. And that's what Tuhiti Thor uh, talks about in the Emerald Tablets of Thor. I don't know how many times I went over that. And each time I read it, I see something new in it. Like, every time I read it, I learn something new. But now, when he talked about the reptilians, and I said, well, I be dang. I said, now the Bible talk about it, but the Bible talk about it in a different way. And then all these other, I said, well, this is it. So it confirmed to me, I don't even remember what day I got out the hospital. But I remember what day I went in. That's the crazy part. I remember what day I went in there. I don't remember. And they was eating at my flesh. Oh, yeah, there's this. They listen before I leave. 
they work in the hot spots that you would never think they work in. And 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 and, and, and you could feel their energy. Like that lady at Walmart yesterday, uh, I made a video about that. Man, I'm telling you, they walk amongst you. And what they want, the only way to defeat them, the only way, listen, even the reptilians who may listen to this video know, like, damn, she telling them my secret. The only way to defeat them when they come across you is pure love. They hate it. They have to walk away. They have to walk away. Now that I think about it, I may do that on my walk and talk, talk about a little bit more deeper because I, 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 I had time to sleep on it. Yeah, everybody that you encounter is not a human. And is there anything else I would like to say? Nope. Just know that they walk a must man unlike man. And I'm out.